Hello, my name's Loader, and welcome back to another How Good Is video. Today we're going to find out how good is Rack and Ruin. Um, this game looks uh, pretty decent. Uh, it's quite cheap on uh, online, so if you're interested in the game, by all means pick it up. Uh, before we jump into the gameplay, I'm just going to show you the options menu quickly. Uh, the they're all pretty limited options, but it's quite a basic looking game to be fair, so you don't need too many options. Um, so we've got all the, all the uh, audio settings you could need. Uh, video, we've just got resolution and full screen or windowed, but don't really need anything else. Uh, gameplay, language, text speed, I'm going to stick to English and normal. Difficulty, I don't know why I can't select that. Maybe you have to complete the game once, I don't, I don't really know. Uh, controls, fully rebindable, which is good, and it also supports controller. Um, I'm going to be using the, I've got my controller plugged in in case I need it, but I'm going to be start using the uh, keyboard and mouse. Alright, so without any further ado, let's jump into a game and see how good is exactly Rack and Ruin. So, a balanced challenge aimed at most players. That sounds good, normal. What do you think we go? Master, I have returned. Another world lies in ruin. Only an asteroid belt remains. An asteroid belt? Rack, what is your mission? To do your bidding, O oh dark and hideous one. And what is my bidding? To conquer all of the universe and cover it in eternal darkness. Exactly! You, however, deliver nothing but asteroids, and asteroids do make poor slaves. Why does Dark Lloyd of the universe need worthless slaves? Silence, you arrogant fool! This will be the last chance you get. You will go to this insignificant world, corrupt it, and deliver it to me. If you so much as think of blowing it up, I will send you to the abyss. Now get out of my sight. As you wish, master. Interesting. He kind of looks like Diablo. In a weird, freaky way. Alright, um, so walk. We can even use Wasad. Or the... Uh, or the analog stick. Um, as I say, we're using the keyboard and mouse first, so we'll use Wasad. Oh, it's all floaty. Oh, not, it's not too floaty, but it's quite floaty. It's kind of like Binding of Isaac, if you ever played that. One of my own kind, so Lord Ruin sends another to conquer this world. Or so he thinks. Aha, now I see. You have been sent here to die. I suffered the same fate, and you, and you will too without my guidance. Failed miserably. How can you help me in any way? Oh wait, you can't. So I wouldn't want to keep you from that cosy looking pile of bones. Nonsense. You have no power in this world. Not yet, at least. I retain something of my failed conquest that you may find useful. Last remnant of Nihil's power. A simple yet highly effective fire spell. This will be reusable attack. Uh, yes? There's no question there, but I'm going to say yes. See, without me, it would just be the next pile of bones in this path. So don't mind me. I won't bother you unless absolutely necessary. Wonderful. How do we shoot? Lock on. Oh, okay. So if, you, if you're using a uh, controller, you have to lock on. But as I'm using keyboard and mouse, I don't have to. Oh, I don't know what they are, but they look cool. Uh, hold spacebar. Womp, 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 womp. Oh, cool. Oh, so once you hold spacebar, you control the block. And not your character. Shoot these. This is kind of like a roguelite looking game, but I don't know if everything's... Uh, I don't know if you, if the everything's the same every time you load the game or whether it's procedurally generated. Always looking, always judging. The eyes of the dead hold no prejudice. Use this item to create an op option that will spin around back. That will spin around rack, releasing extra firepower. I think they mean potion. Rockbuster bombs are generally used for mining purposes, however, Rack probably can find other uses. Hell yeah! Okay, so we've got the inventory down the bottom, that's good. Q and E to toggle items, or A and B. Q. Alright, Q is change. Use change weapons. 
Oh no, Q and E are change. Like change what your active uh, thingy is. Use items right click. So right click. That's the eyeball. Nice. Shoot that. Oh no. It's oh, right. okay. I thought it was going to infinitely duplicate. That would have been rubbish. Alright. Do I go down? Nope. Do I go up? Okay. Whoa! The eyeball causing damage. That was good. I'm really liking this game so far. It's really engaging. And it's, it's got like a cutesy art style, like hand drawn art style, which is really, really nice. Whoa, dear! Didn't see this line. Alright, let's collect the enemy. Oh, there we go. This is what I'm collecting. So, wherever that is, that button is what I'm picking up. I assume there's some kind of currency for upgrades and stuff. We will see. Doesn't look like the slimes drop anything, they? Ah! How's it got up here? What's this? Inventory tab. Ooh. While meditating, Rack and Body's himself shield. Okay, cool. Where's my... Uh, oh, here we go. So that's probably health and mana or something? Alright, what's this? Is that health? Oh no, it's just extra... Uh, I imagine that probably is health, because red jars usually are. Alright, let's go up here. Please look suspicious. Oh. I thought they'd have monsters in, like in Pokemon. Pokemons! It's kind of like, it feels like a mix between several games. It feels kind of like um, Don't Starve as well. But obviously not as dark. Yeah, I think killing the slimes is pointless, but I think I If this game has upgrades, I'm going to probably wear myself. What is that? Do you reckon that was health? I think so. That's a human dude. Whoa! Some kind of boss. Oh, it's not very, not very awesome, but BUNNY! Kill the bunny. Feels like there should be a mini map. Is oh, there's a big map. Whoa, it's quite a big map. Oh, no, I get is that another R I can pick up? Ow. Okay, there's definitely my health on top left. That's good. Good to know. And then we can find out if this red vial fills it up. It does. I don't know what the other eye gave me, but oh well. Alright, let's go this way! I feel I missed, a, missed something at the very start. But I'm not going back now. Oh dear! Oh, here we go. Look! A shrine of the goddess! This is going to be a habit with, Is this going to be a habit with you? Of course not! I only appear when the situation calls for it. Which is never. It relies on me on the importance of this situation. These shrines are pathway to the very soul of the world. Just offer the souls you've collected to the shrine. When enough souls have been offered, it will tear a hole in reality that will open a path through our next world. Okay. When your power, will, uh, then your power will grow, and this world will slip further into the ruins of grasp. I assume I wasn't aware of this tidbit. I certainly haven't left thousands of smouldering ruins in my wake. Okay, so I have to have 40 to pass. I've got 184. Good. Do that. Do I fire? E. Yep. Oh, hold space. Uh, I said it right there. Nice. I'm loving this game so far. It's very, it's very interesting. New powers have been bestowed on you, but be warned. The rift you have opened has allowed powerful feral demons to roam this land. Okay. A taste of ruin's power bestowed on you to you across the dimensional rift. This short melee spell will regenerate magic with each hit. Each hit. Okay. No honor amongst evil, I guess. I mean, it's not like you, you listen to me, nor I ruin. Nor I to ruin. I guess it's a mutual hateful existence. Okay. What's that? Oh, I, I guess let's go back to the first world. Ow. That just hurts. Okay. Let's go this way. Toggle weapon. Irrelevant. Ooh, what's this house? I'm going in. 
Oh, scary witch lady. Great. Just when I thought the annoying part was over. <laughs> yeah, my little fish bone. Hee hee hee. Now if you'd kindly hop into my pot, I have a stew that could use some demon horn spice. Now I've missed these jokes. They never get old. You see my face? And all the laughter? I'm gonna laugh so hard I'll die. And you'll finally get your wish. I think I'll get that once Ruin is done with her. We can only help. Now, how does this arrangement work again? You showless hag. I thought you would never ask. You see, myself and other merchants will encounter... You will encounter... We'll sell you anything your shriveled up heart desires. Wait, there are other merchants? Why am I still talking to you? Because I possess the ability to create more of any item. For a small fee, of course. Never worry, though. I'll make sure you get the friendly price. By friendly, you mean gouging with Christ knife. Christ knife. How do you think I've stayed in business so long? By being a rotten demonic hag who can harp the interdimensional rift in search of anything that will prolong your hideous existence? <gasps> but of course, ripping me off across the ages is probably part of part is probably part of it as well. Great. Just when I thought the annoying part was over. Shut up. Rotten toe. Gangrenous and rotten. This horrid swell smelling toe leaves a rotten trail wherever it goes. That sounds interesting. Blood of the innocent. Okay, that's a health patient. Ooh, a really expensive health patient. Hellfire Tornado. This smoldering book contains the last known written instructions for the Hellfire Tornado spell. That sounds amazing and I want it. Spiky Bomb. Okay. Cool. Uh, I'm not going to buy a thing now. Let's leave. See you later. Red slime. Whoa. Getting all up in my grill. What the hell? Oh, right. That red stuff hurts me. That's really annoying. The blood of the... Yeah, damn. Stay away, Mr. Blob. Does it disappear after time? Oh, okay. I just have to dodge it. That's really annoying. I really want to go down this way. Oh. No, I don't want to go down this way. Or do I? No, I'm going to go this way and see what we find. Oh my goodness. I was not expecting that. Alright, what's this? Gimme. Go south. I don't wanna. There's red blobs down there. What the hell is that? What have we here? Another foul demon come to burn the fires of justice? If I say yes. I was looking for your opinion, creature. You'll pay for impunging your filth upon our world. Rid this dimension of your foul self or suffer the consequences. <laughs> Get lost, you overgrown lizard, before I make myself a new pair of shoes. <laughs> they must have bred that ignorance into you. So be it. Uh oh. Oh my god! Yeah, go home, little knights. Basilicious cowardice. One word warning. That bastard's cowardice is Lady Ammon, protector of this world. She breathes fiery justice with flames hotter than the sun. Her breath was the last torment my physical self ever knew. You have her to thank for making the demonic dream team of Rack and Nihil a possibility. On that note, I'm definitely going to kill her first. Oh, I want that. Jimmy. How do I... Okay, I can't power it from here. That's annoying. I have to find a thing. I have to find a switch. Oh, hey. How hideously, how hideously delightful. A village. Each soul here is a delicate flower waiting to wilt in the face of its world's demise. And in the end, they will run 
and and rip themselves apart. And end. I mean, I'm an inter interdimensional being who can teleport around the universe, and running seems like a good idea. Well, you can't teleport. You can use Ruin's power to teleport, but without him, you're nothing. Okay. I'm perfectly capable of killing. Point taken. Oh, look, a well. Oh, a well. What a great place to start. Poisoning the water is a timeless tradition. Oh, I'm being in it. <laughs> ah, nice. Hello, teach him. Oh, not that. Die, foul being. Why should I die? <laughs> My mother says I shouldn't talk with strangers, but Mew Mew here likes your big horns. That's right, baby. What's that thing you're carrying? Mew Mew, you call him? He's not a thing, he's a kitty. You tell him, you tell him Mew Mew. Hey, dogs! I knew someone who'd pay a good price for, for that tail of his. You mean tail is not for sale, silly! And I don't think he likes your horns anymore. Unfortunately, that was a one-time offer. Well, run along, child, and fetch your mother some water from the well. You get. What's this? Give me, give me the fish. You, fisherman. Good day, stranger. Care to join me some fishing? You mean sitting on this wooden contraption for hours waiting for a free meal? Yep. What do you say, stranger? I do have an appointment with a giant lizard, but sure, why not? Right on, buddy. Let me tell you a legend. Oh. Long go the world. No one cares. No one cares. I've dodged planets. No one cares. No one cares about what you have to say, fisherman. No one cared. No one cared. No cares about they were given. What's this? Give me. Give me this! I demand you! I don't understand. How do I pick that up? Oh, I want it! Oh, wait, let's try. What does it say? Cascade Bluffs. Yeah, great! I don't know why I'm destroying the fishes, there's never anything in them. I was going here. Hello, wizard! Astounding, a demon from the nether! I've read one of your kind in books. But to see one in the flesh is a treat indeed. I must make a detailed account of our meeting. This will certainly be our last. At least you've read enough to know you won't survive long. Oh no, something like that. Amon is going to kill you before you get a mile outside the village. Really? You've got that much faith in Overgrown Lizard? Of course! She's done it many times. About 50 years ago, my grandfather said he caught sight of the little guy before Lady Amon burst him into a crisp. Little guy! Who do you think he was referring to? And did I say he'd come out? Mm. Who are you talking to? Believe it or not, nothing. Now, I thank you for your encouragement, but I must be on my way. Uh, there is a big lizard out there who isn't going to skew herself. Amazing. Alright, give me these. What's that? Ancient bits of technology, they're imbued with the power of absorption. This item can can be placed in the world and will react to different damage types. Okay. Good. Ooh. Go in here. Where is she? Have you seen my daughter? Yes. She is she small and have a cling it. Yeah. Is she small and has a habit of clinging to some mangy beast? The one up the one down by the well. Good. She's such a worry. Uh-huh. Well it seems your daughter is enough danger with you with you as a parent. I'll be leaving now. Let me open this. Let me open the box. Oh yeah, give me the green drip. Oh, that was mana. What's that? More points! Oh, that? Red. Hey, right there. Can I break this? I can. Give me the health. You, adventurer. You seem concerned. Excuse me, do I know you? Nope, but I saw your nervous pacing, so I assumed you were concerned. 
I certainly am. The forest itself here turned foul. You wouldn't happen to be the one responsible. Certainly not. Well, not to be rude, but you have got red eyes and look like a demon. I'm going to assume you know, you know what happened. Okay, I was kidding. It was totally me. That's not funny. <laughs> really? Because I'm laughing! <laughs> God has protect us. If you excuse me, I have to think about a way to clean up your mess. Get to work, because there's more coming. Oh my god, there's lots of talking in this game. Lots of... Whoa, he's a tubber. Tubster. You have some nerve showing up here in our village, creature. A thousand page essay on why I shouldn't roast you and eat your liver. Do it in five seconds. Your empty threads don't scare me. Lady Armand will cleanse your filth from my village. Speaking of empty threads, this whole village seems to have a lot of real estate tied up in your faith of that lizard. Might suggest some independent thinking. I don't need advice from you. Now get out of our village. I think I'll make myself a home. See you around. Humph. Alright then, I could quite happily continue playing this game for probably the next 300,000 hours. Um, however, I have to be fair to the other games. It has been 21 minutes since I started, so I'm going to have to, uh, I think I'm going to have to wrap up my review. Um, if you have a spare amount of money lying around, pick up this game. I highly recommend it. Um, I've only played 20 minutes, uh, but what I've seen, it's amazing. It's kind of like... Um, I don't know, it just feels like a mix of loads of games. It kind of feels like a c cartoony Diablo, in a weird way. Um, but yeah, hope you enjoyed this video, and I'm going to wrap it up there. Uh, keep an eye on my channel for other reviews of new games. Uh, don't forget to subscribe and like, and I'll see you next time. See ya!